When I awoke from my dreamless sleep, I was just in time to witness the end of the world. Yes. You want to save. The legends had told of her coming. Banisher of darkness. Bringer of light. Redeemer of souls. She'd come at the end of days to guide our souls to salvation. Damn you, lightning! What's it gonna be? You gonna try to kill me? Huh? <laughs> 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 Death, Light. So now what? This is the bit where you save my soul? I could help you, if that's what you want. Damn it! What kind of answer is that? <laughs> uh-uh. Now that isn't going to work. I swear that kid is a demon. Angels of death and demons? You're attracting the wrong crowd, Snow. Oh. No one is gonna stop me. You hear? Not you, definitely not her. If I have to fight the savior, then I will.
The centuries have changed us, Snow and me. Once we fought desperately together against our fates. Now he's patron of a never-ending revel, presiding over a banquet at the end of the world. And I've become the savior. I'm a servant of God, sent to a world being consumed by chaos. Tell me, Snow. Has ever a day passed when you haven't thought about Sarah? The girl you loved, my younger sister. How long has she been gone now? She brought us together and made us allies and friends. I can't give her back to you, but I can save your soul and free you from your long torment. It'll be my first act as savior. Mr. Hope best time. Any ideas? What do I do next? Blake, come on. Just call me Hope, okay? Right now, your number one priority is Snow. Don't let him get away. <laughs> time can't be stopped. Deemed safe. I guess that means clearing out all the monsters, right? at last. Is the savior a sign of coming destruction or a promise of hope? I would like to bet on hope. If you believe you are the true savior, you'll need to be carefully prepared for the battles that await you on your journey. You need to hurry. 
What's Snow up to anyway? Where's he going? I'm getting sent home from chaos readings from inside the map. Chaos? Is he going there to try to stop it, or is it to use it against us somehow? You'll have to ask him yourself. How high is the obstruction? Light, you should be able to jump over it. He liked to look after people, but lording it over an entire city? Well, it wasn't his choice. He started out just trying to help everyone, and eventually, he became ruler by popular acclaim. I'll release your soul. Doesn't look like he's enjoying it much, though. When I looked into his eyes, I didn't see much of the old snow. Chaos is in the middle of the palace, right? It doesn't... Right, can you hear me? The chaos is powerful in this area. I'm not sure what's going on. It's interfering with my secret source. I'll try to maintain the connection. There's a chance we'll get caught. What are you doing here? If you're playing around in the middle of this chaos, 
I'm guessing you're not human. <laughs> You can see when you're inside this stuff? Hmm. Then you can't be one of God's regular lackeys, can you? Listen, Hope, I need more info. Can you analyze this chaos matter for me? I've been trying to do just that, but it's no good. None of my instruments will tell me anything. It's just too hard to see. What do you mean? I'm not sure. The sensors know... It's locked. Can I force it? That might be beyond even you. Hold on a second. I'll see what I can do from here. <gasps> hmm, there's a lot of chaos building up back there. Yes, indeed. And Snow's inside, or whatever's left of him. Well, he has been living without hope for centuries. Now the world's about to end. He might have lost his mind entirely. If it were anyone else, I'd say that was a given. Do you think it could have gotten to him, though? Broken even his spirit? I hope not, but... <gasps> Light! You've been spotted! You've gotta get out of there, now! After coming all this way? I'm his last chance, damn it. I know what he's going through. The pain of losing Sarah. That's true. If there's anything left of Snow, as the savior, you're the only one who can rescue him. That's why you have to protect yourself. If you're killed, it really will mean the end of the world. And then who can you save? All right, fine. Take me back to the Ark. Hold on. So she'll understand his pain? She thinks she's going to save his soul? Would you listen to this nonsense? Ugh, God turns her into the savior and it all goes straight to her head. Once upon a time, I committed a terrible sin. It happened long ago, in a past that I cannot change. I was fighting a war that never ended. I thought I was saving the world, and I needed help. So I turned to Sarah, the only family I had. She was my younger sister. I sent her to her death. I knew what I did could not be forgiven, but I prayed that someday it could be undone. 
dreaming of the day I might bring her back. I fell into a long sleep. It was a sleep as dark as death. The centuries passed, and each one seemed like an eternity until... One day, the light touched me. I knew what it was. It was God himself speaking to me. All-powerful, all-knowing, ruler of the world and sky above, Bonavelza. The light was his voice, and I felt warmth on my skin as it spoke. He told me what I had to do. I would be his servant, and if I succeeded in doing his bidding, my reward would be a miracle. He said she would live again. My sister, Sarah, and I'd have her back at last. And so I was chosen by God to rescue lost souls and guide them past the end of this world and into the next. I became the savior. Light, there's something I want to tell you. Something I think you have to hear. It'll take some explaining, so when you have the time, come and talk to me.